Local agencies worked together with the Wyoming National Guard during Sweetwater County's Big Bang exercise. A Rock Springs compression station and set of transmission lines were the sites for simulated attacks on infrastructure. Months of planning and coordination led to a chance for involved parties to evaluate their operation plans and to become familiar with one another in the case of an actual emergency situation. The goal is of the Wyoming Army National Guard is to work closely with emergency managers in, in exercises, either large scale such as this one or small scale. And we've seen over the course of the last few years with the floods and the fires that those close relationships that we've built have really paid off. In order to remain the state's National Guard reaction force, the soldiers of the 960th's Bravo Company used this opportunity to begin their biannual certification. Their role is one of support to local communities with capabilities including perimeter and checkpoint security, crowd dispersion, and riot control. A group of citizen volunteers acted as media representatives, inquisitive bystanders, and potential threats to security in order to make the scenario as realistic as possible. Every time that I go out and do exercises like this, it really brings home the, the community atmosphere of the state of Wyoming and, and it really brings out to me um, citizens of Wyoming wanting to help each other. It also brings home the point that, that soldiers really, um, really do serve the communities in which they live. Even though a lot of soldiers don't live in this county, Wyoming is, is basically a, a huge county. In an effort to develop strong relationships with local communities, the National Guard Reaction Force schedules similar trainings in different counties on a quarterly basis. Reporting from Rock Springs, Wyoming, I'm Specialist Amanda Predis, the 197th Public Affairs Detachment.